What's up? What's up? It's DJ Eddie F, and you're watching EntertainmentReporters.com. He brought us out to New York, and um, and when we got to his crib, he, he had like it was like six or seven different artists that was already living there, so it was kind of like a like a small like folk town. And he brought my I had four my members. Trip. I had four members in my group, and um, and when he brought us down. It was like, we was just sleeping everywhere, man. It's just like, he already knew what he wanted to do. And I, I was looking like a songwriter back then. Um, I kind of knew how to write and, and produce a little bit, but being around him, he put me around a lot of different songwriters. I learned from Kenny Green how to kind of write songs. And then I learned from uh, uh, Dave Paul, him, and, and, and his whole crew, how to really start to produce songs. I knew how to play, but not make a real record. So I really appreciate this guy for really bringing me into the music business and the music world. Um, I want everything to this guy for, for really just showing me how to be a producer and just, you know, make music. So then I want to take it back for you. Coming up, obviously you came from Chicago. When you look at the Chicago scene, Chicago music scene, and you look at artists now, really it's a rap scene, you look at Lil Baby, and you look at Lil Dirk and Chief Keith. From your era, when you were coming up, who were some people that you looked up to, and, and, and tell us what the Chicago music scene was like. Oh, of course, R. Kelly, you know what I'm saying, that's, that's the first guy you gotta really look up to. Oh, uh, there, there was a lot of groups in Chicago that that, uh, that we kind of looked up to. There's still a group in uh, Chicago by the name of Shy Hill. Um, um, it was a lot of groups, but we really couldn't get, get signed to Chicago for some reason. Everywhere we went, we did a lot of shows around Chicago. You know what I'm saying? I can't get signed. You know what I'm saying? Why? 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 It ain't nothing happening in Chicago exactly. on that matter. Yeah. So, I mean, but um, just growing up in Chicago, man, beautiful place. You know, we, uh, 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 we just did a lot of shows everywhere, man, just trying to get signed. And we didn't get that, so we just went to, to the BRE one year and uh, stood outside and sung for everybody who walked out. And this guy happened to be on them. And he actually did what he said he was going to do. He signed us. Yo, what's up? It's your boy Donnell Jones, and you are checking out entertainmentreporters.com. Y'all keep it Like, like, 
people that worked on like all of those records um, that was signed to Untouchables. And I mean, it's like now when I look back, you know, at the time you don't know that you're like affecting culture and history. You're just trying to make good music. Right. Then you look back and say, man, we really made an impact on the culture. Because so, people don't see the behind the scenes, they see the head. Right. But they don't see that you went through and just make it. You right. know what I mean? You ain't, right. They don't know you don't really think about like this going to be a hit. You, you hope it will be a hit. Right. But you really just wow. coming from your heart at that point. Right. So for it to be a hit, I can't imagine how it is. Right. Because I know. <laughs> I can't say that for you, but this is DJ Eddie for y'all. Y'all, for real. Come on. Legendary. We appreciate you out here, man. Happy birthday. Thank you. Happy birthday. Happy birthday. Thank you. Thank you. Happy birthday to you, too, man. I know, right. Yes. You know how the Aries do it. Yeah, right. Exactly. We do everything great. Know that. <laughs> you know what I mean? EntertainmentReporters.com, Cutty Shaw, DJ Eddie Hale. Let's go. Happy birthday, dear Eddie. Happy birthday to This is Ian Burke, music consultant here in Atlanta, Georgia. Worked with a lot of talented artists that came up from the city. And right now, you're watching EntertainmentReporters.com. This is your boy Cuddy Shaw. I am live and direct. EntertainmentReporters.com. I am here with the one and only Ian Burke, who started mostly everything here in Atlanta. If you will say, if I'm not being too, you know, out there with it, but this is a humble man. You know, so let's get it here. Ian, man, yes, sir. we are proud to have you here at Eddie F's birthday party featuring Donnell Jones. But this is the man who made it all happen, if I can say that again. So tell me how you feel about being here tonight. I feel great. You know, Eddie F is a long time uh, friend, associate and friend, and um, I wanted to be out here to help him celebrate his birthday and support Kevin Shine's event. So, um, it's a great thing, right. What I really want to ask you, when we was in a place and you had all the TLC joints coming on and knowing that that is like some, some birthing things going on, how did right. you feel right. hearing that and how was it working with them? Well, I mean, you know, it, was, it felt good, you know what I'm saying? And, and you know, it felt good to know that Eddie was a part of those situations and, and doing the remixes and things of that nature. So, you know, anytime. You know, you you hear something that you work with. Right. You know, whether DJ's playing it, you hear it on the radio, you hear it in a in the Kroger store. It just makes you feel good. So. Right. And I want to say personally to you, mm -hmm. like for me to you, like we appreciate you out here. Thank you. I mean, that, I mean, that, to hear that music, like it, I'm hyped right now. You know <laughs> what I mean? And it still gets everybody hyped. People that didn't even know it, that it was another generation that came up under that. Right. And they know this. Right. So music that you helped make, they know. So like, in a way, you would live forever. Oh uh, yeah. Yeah. It's nice to know. Yeah. Nice to have a little legacy out there. You know, um, and not so much on the music side, but um, mm -hmm. just working with the artists. Um, but you know, like it's it's what I do. You know, what I live yeah. for is my passion, and you know, you know, I'm gonna do it for as long as I can. All right. Everybody, EntertainmentReporters.com. Ian Burke, professionalism at its best, music at its best. This is a heart and soul thing. This is not a game. This is not just for fun. People are born to do this. So know that. In, in your craft, you do it. What did your heart feels, you do. In Jesus' name, let's get it. Once again, right, this is your boy right. Cuddy Shark, EntertainmentReporters.com. I'm with, this is a Shot town thing right here. You know what I'm Born and bred Shot town right here. You know what I mean, what's going on. Donnell Jones is in the building. You know what's up. Literally and figuratively, you know what's up. All right, this is the boy Donnell Jones, man. What's going on? How you doing this evening? Oh, man, I'm great, man. You know, I just came out, man, to pull up with Andy F, man. You know, his birthday is out today. And, uh, you know, just show some love to some up-and-coming artists, man. I remember, you know, being back in Chicago and being an up-and-coming artist, man. We used to do stuff like, uh, uh, Elroy, GCI used to have this, this, this convention that he used to do. He used to go 
and see all the artists, you know. So I just wanted to come back, man, just show my love to you know, some of these young up and coming artists that's coming out right now. Yeah. And you know you're old school now, right? Man, you know. You're like, yeah, I'm old school right now. You know what I mean? I mean, I've been in the game for about 20 years, so I guess that is old school. Right, you know what's up? Eddie F, man, this is Uptown Records, this is the face, this is everything, this is legendary, like music, real music. Man, how do you feel about where you came from up until this point right now? I feel beautiful, man. You know what I'm saying? I mean, you know, young brother from Chicago, South Side, man. You know, I, I never really thought I'd, I'd. My whole life was was four square miles. You know, just around my neighborhood. You know, nine years into the world. You know, the music has taken me to places that I never thought that I would ever see. You know, and so I feel I feel honored. I feel blessed. I feel like you know God really has yeah. let me see some things in my lifetime, man. and it's beautiful. So. Yeah, I appreciate that. Yeah, we love you out here in the streets, man. For real. We watch you. You did some great things. You made music what it is. And, you know, I know you're doing what you do. Thank you. From outside of you. You very well. You know, it's, 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 you know, it's, it's so many talented people that have come and gone, and so many people that have just come and come. And, you know, music is just like, it's just a revolving door. It's going to keep going around and going around. Yo, what's up? It's your boy Donnell Jones, and you are checking out entertainmentrecorders.com. Y'all keep it right Entertainmentreporters.com. You do, you're actually a plus.